Well, the Lakers uh, right now in danger of uh, dropping back into a tie with the Utah Jazz for that eighth and final playoff spot, and here's why. This is uh, th one of three games remaining for the Jazz at home. Al Jefferson was huge Ooh. visiting Minnesota. I mean, huge in this game. Timberwolves here falling asleep at the end of the first quarter. Gordon Hayward okay. <laughs> wide awake for the three. He'll take it. A big smile. Got to play to the horn. Yep. 30 to 22 Utah in front. J.J. Barea. Nice. He was a fly in the ointment tonight as far as the Jazz was concerned. 23 <laughs> in the game. And then Timberwolves in transition. Ricky Rubio to Luke Ridnour. Touch pass to Kira Lincoln. Kira Lincoln returning to Utah. Minnesota's up by one at the half. Look at Big Al. I'm giving that. This face-up game is mm. starting to be potent. Great touch. And watch okay. him again. Don't give him the pump oh. fake. What you call it, uh, Nate? The one-hand George McGinnis? <laughs> Go get it, Al. Go over the left shoulder. It's over. Berea in the middle of things. Oh. Alec Burks pushes Berea. Into Derek Favors, the foul's called on Berea. And then Al Jefferson misses, going back up court. Derek Favors popping Berea, sending him to the floor. Yeah, look at J.J. He gets about mm. one or two of those a game. Oh, yeah, and huh? that's a flagrant one on Favors. And that got everybody fired up. Berea this time dribbling and up finding Rubio. Rubio for three. Minnesota was making this tough for the Jazz. It was coming down. To the end and then big Al sure. again. He has he has to turn the other shoulder, right? Yeah, you gotta you make gotta, him. You gotta make him turn the other way. You want more of Al? Here yes, you go. sir. That's shoulder. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> McGinnis. <Yeah. laughs> 40 and 13 in the game. That's right, 40. Last chance for Minnesota. Berea. He's gonna shoot the three, but Faber's got a piece of it. And it goes out on Minnesota. The Jazz seal it up at the line and win 107 to 100 behind Al Jefferson, who has his, I mean, ties his career high with 40. What a game.